and welcome to this new video today it's time for another unboxing and i have a package here and i'm gonna unbox it i have no clue what's inside well i know there's coffee inside i know it comes from canada but i don't know which roaster um i guess it's for filter but i'm not 100 sure so let's check it out so i got this collaboration with cafe climbers cafe climbers is an instagram account we've been talking on instagram for a long time and then they said like we could send you a coffee we could do a collaboration so i sent a coffee um from oslo to to them in canada to cafe climbers um, you can also see that in my special Christmas video. If you haven't seen it, you can check it here. This is their Instagram account. So, Cafe Climbers. So, check it out. Thank you guys for sending me this awesome coffee. It's funny because I live in Catalonia. It's a geisha, red honey. Wow. Mm -hmm. From Guatemala. I love the bag. What do you guys think of this bag? With this design on the side. This yellow. I really like the, the bag. Wow. It's super cool. Hey, let's find out something about Pilot Coffee Roasters. Because I don't know. Here it is. Specialty Coffee Roaster from Toronto, Canada. Offering selection of single origin coffees with plus signature blends. Direct trade. Oh, I'm so impressed by the bag. It looks amazing. And I love that it, the name. I love it. I think he kind of picked it because I live in Barcelona. This is the website. What drives us is our passion. What guides us are our core commitments to quality, innovation, and exceptional service. Our mantra, the perfect roast is only possible if it begins with a perfect green bean. That's very true. Super cool. So check their website. It's a very nice website. Let's go to the coffee. I'm gonna wait with opening it. I'm gonna check first the outside. Priority is Geisha very curious because geishas are mostly the most expensive beans in the world because they have such a good name <laughs> but sometimes they they are not too good it's just being a good geisha let's see then it's a red honey process red honey process means you have natural you have washed you have semi-washed and semi-washed you can also say it's like a honey process and then you have different steps in honey process like you have white honey yellow honey red honey it means how much flesh you leave around the bean when drying i hope it makes sense <laughs> i don't see the notes oh yeah there was uh, honey vanilla so yeah it's in french because it comes from canada oh silky so it should be silky <laughs> maybe we should open the bag exciting Ooh, smells good. Very small beans. So it's time to grind these beans and make a coffee with it. And it, you will see in part two. Welcome to part two of this unboxing video. It's time to brew the coffee. I just ground the coffee at my job. And let's make an AeroPress. I'm going to use two filters. I put them in here and I'm going to rinse them. Today I'm making a mess from everything. I've weighed 15 grams of coffee. As you might know, I don't have a scale, so I'm gonna do it on the feeling, but I'm gonna measure the time. <laughs> I'm using a pre of 100 grams for 30 seconds. Okay. 
So now I put the rest of the water. I want to put 250 grams of water. It's almost around number four. Okay. And now let's wait. I'm gonna wait one and a half minutes and then I'm gonna press. So now it starts sizzling. That's the moment you stop. Let's put it on top of this. And here we have the coffee. It doesn't have that much now. Mm -hmm. It's quite citric. It's a bit plain. So maybe I could change the grind size a little bit. So I'm definitely gonna try this coffee another time, uh, maybe at work with a V60, just to see the difference, but it's pretty sweet and citric. I didn't extract all the flavors from the coffee. I'm, I totally have to try it another time, but for sure, I, I'm 100% sure that I can make a really, really good coffee out of this one. And I, and I love the name and I love the packaging. Yeah, so here I am again. Um, I wasn't that happy with the coffee that I made uh, for the unboxing video with the, the pilot coffee, the Catalan de las Mercedes. It wasn't that fruity and sweet as I expected it to be. So I've tried two times um, with some colleagues at work. Uh, one time it came out a bit the same and then the other time it was slightly better. I've talked with the guy who sent me the coffee and he told me that sometimes he has the same when he takes coffee from Barcelona to Canada and said it could be the water. So yeah, it was, it was a pity, I was like, I, I'm gonna try, try it on my time. I just made a French press. I use different kind of water and, and it's, it's a little bit better, but still it's not that fruity and that sweet as I expected from uh, a geisha um, red honey process that says it should taste like honey and vanilla. I don't get the flavors out, which is such a pity. That's good to know. I hope I can try it once in Canada and in maybe in the grocery of Pilot. That would be awesome. And then I would probably see the difference. So this is the end of this video. I want to say thank you for watching. Thank you Cafe Climbers for sending this awesome coffee. And do you want to see your coffee here? That I try out your coffee. You can always send your coffee. Let me know. You can send an email or problem we can even do a collaboration i can send you some coffee you send me some coffee no problem would be awesome to have more unboxing videos and you know what to do when you like the video and you can subscribe to my channel don't forget it's very easy you just have to press the button 